Hello everybody, welcome back to another Photoshop tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to restore and fix old photos. In this one here, I've got an 1843 image of John Quincy Adams, the uh, President of the United States. Let's go ahead and restore this image. The first step, make sure you've got the image loaded. Select your layer, go up to Filter, and then go to Neural Filters. I want you to note that I am in the beta for this one. I'm in the Photoshop beta. But this here, this Neural Filter, is just in the final process of getting figured out and it will be in the regular version shortly. The first step is at the bottom, you're going to see photo restoration as one of the new neural filters. Turn that bad boy on. The first time you turn it on, keep in mind, it's a pretty large download. It's about 800 megabytes, but there you go. We've already gone ahead and made some changes. Off, on. It's already done a pretty good job. It's got rid of a lot of the noise, especially make sure that enhance face is on. Also note, you can reduce the scratches even further. It goes to a default of 20, but let's say if I jack this up to 50, it will begin processing again in a few short seconds. And presto, we're gonna have even better looks. So you guys can adjust this as you see fit. Finally, keep in mind, you can also do further adjustments. Again, it's processing. You can do noise reduction. If you, right now, I've got no noise reduction on, but if I wanna drop it down a little bit, Go ahead, just keep in mind that if you zoom in, it does soften the features quite a bit. So again, use that as you see fit. Now, if you wanted to restore the image even further and then make it color, even though it wasn't shot in color, just click on Colorize and presto, now you've got a color restored image. That's all there is. It's the photo restoration, then colorize. And then as you see fit, you can go ahead and adjust some of the colors. For example, there's too much magenta in that, for my opinion. in my opinion saturation I would drop it down a little bit to make it look nice and old again adjust them as you see fit that's how you restore photos in seconds thanks for watching ton more stuff coming up